Nigerians have hailed Bianco Juku as heroine for slapping Obiano's wife. Welcome to the news and thank you for tuning in to listen. Nigerians have hailed the wife of late Biafra warlord Bianco Juku for slapping the f wife of former governor of Anambra State, Bele Chuku Obiano, on Thursday. Bianca delivered a hot slap to the face of Ebele Chuku when the latter looked for her trouble at the inauguration of Prof. Charles Chukwemeka Chukwuma Soludo as governor of Anambra State. Ebele Chuku stood up and walked majestically to Bianca's seat and delivered some harsh words to her ears, and she responded by giving her the slap of the century. Reacting on Twitter, Nigerians hailed Bianca for a feed, saying Obiano's wife looked for trouble and got what she deserved. Reacting, Onye Zioko said she is a widow. That is one of the challenges widows get to face daily in a society, just because her cover has gone. Imagine if her husband was alive and seated beside her. Would that bell Obiano's wife have the guts to walk up to her and insult her? Women value your husband, Elvis Murphy said. Thank you, Bianca, for giving her and gracing her with a world deserved farewell slap. Okute could not believe what he heard. Eberu Biano did. Shameful. Atagilis added, How dare you run to General's wife and expect her to imply you with mouth? Now slap straight up. Another wrote, A farewell slap. What a disgraceful ending. And so Biano's wife collected a hot slap for Bianco Juku for not minding her business. According to Dipo, you left your seat to go and talk trash, and now you have chopped and chewed slap from your fellow woman, at which folks who repeatedly trash talk and deliberately try to bring her the same to disrepute on social media can get this instant judgment besides blocking. A Twitter user said, Some people we are seeing hailing Bianca after giving Osedeme Obiano the valedictory slap. Another opined, Wife of Wife of late life of Inkebane with late chief Odumebo Chuku Ameka Ojuku looks so calm and gentle here. You can't believe she'll slap an outgoing governor's wife. Indiana Ambra said Mrs. Abelo Biano used cost words on her. Ima Ome said some of you do not know how the wicked former first lady was. Mrs. Abelo Obiano once slapped the former deputy governor of Anambra State when the husband was a governor. Imagine slapping your husband's deputy. That was how useless the woman was. I wish Bianca would slap her again. Another said, The VAR check is complete. The slap of the year was delivered by Bianca Ujuku on behalf of all the people of Anambra State. Thank you for your service. The street will not forget. Congratulations to Indian Anambra worldwide. Another person pinned, Mrs. Obiano finally made history. She was the outgoing first lady to receive outgoing slap. Congratulations, Ma. History will never forget you. All hail, Bianca Ujuku. Another person reposted, and that was how Bianca Ujuku was seated quietly, minding her own business, until Unsubuwan walked up to her with her wahala. The religious slap was worth it in the end. Another opinion, Abela is not liked by lots of Fungian Ambra. People just tolerated the excesses because of her status, First Lady. Now, there are few slaps to remind her that every regime must come to an end someday. Another opinion, if I was slap, you cannot buy class with money. See how Bianca was maintaining beauty while the supposed outgoing first lady is acting like a wolf. Bianca won. Bianca won. Won no umba for you. Another opinion, Mrs. Obiano walked to where she collected her slap. No good to the to Jabolesha. She equaled eight years of slap with two seconds of hot slap. Another opinion. Thank you for serving justice to lots of Anambra today. You have once again written your name in the hus in the books of history. Chogo Gazegi Me. Hey Nigerians, two people have roasted this woman. Ah Ah <laughs> To think that I was even saying ah Bianca Ojuku, that's the late widow of, um, I mean, sorry, the late wife of, um, you know, General Ojuku. I was thinking that I was even saying, uh uh, at least the woman should have showed me, in my own opinion, she should have showed her class. 
classes you ignore. If she's do too much, you faint call. Even if, okay, you, even if not even faint call, you can even call somebody and even say, "Look at the, I did somewhere they didn't look for my trouble." But she didn't do that. Instead, she slapped. Hmm. And people are hailing her. Huh? I'm a Nigerian, sure. Hmm. Somebody's asking, "Are you a divert? What is childish about her acts? That Ebele deserves more slap than she got." Okay. Bianca, well done for that well deserved quality slap. What a way to send eight years ring. Validatory slap from a generous wife. I guess she will never forget. <laughs> At least she made history today by being the first lady with the first word slap. She did disgrace to her husband, honestly. If she could not respect herself, she would have respected her husband. Is Bianca her mate, a world class beauty queen, a warless wife, and a governor's wife? Come on. Hey. My people, this is why I said I love you. I love you for my brain. Eh? <laughs> See how Bia friends are commenting on the feud between their daughters. What if the victim or the slapper is from other region? Ah, is this the way King Solomon did judge in Israel? Are you people claiming, and you people are claiming descendants of Israel? This is how you'll be ruling in your Biafra. Wahala deal. <laughs> oh God, they will come for you. Me, I'm here. Sincerely, I'm even here saying that, okay, she should have just ignored, you know, just ignore her. Let it now be. Let the camera that was really showing the way she matched and matched and come. You will fail your call, you continue. Then, if she now come and do any other thing, then, you know, whatever follows, Nigeria will say she even ignored her for some time. Okay? <laughs> One does not even know the truth. Different stories everywhere. Someone said the belly walked up to Bianca and slapped her. Someone said it was Bianca that slapped her belly after walking up to her and insult her. Hmm. Me and just the laugh in Ibusha. Somebody, okay, the report said Obiano's wife walked up to her and asked Bianca what she was doing there. That she, Bianca, said they are not going to be in the election. And she then called Bianca a witch before Bianca slapped her. Me and not dead here, oh. Hey, I cannot confirm this side of the story. But the video was there for you to watch and judge your own. Obiano walked to Bianca's seat and started abusing her with negative words before the slap landed on her cheek. She's not what is to be a first lady, however, the whole slap is the center of gifts and also well deserved. <laughs> Charity begins at her. Me too, my brother. Even though I'm laughing at this, I'm also saying I maintain my stand. Mrs. Bianca Ujuku would have just maintained her class. Ah! She should have showed her there are levels to things. You don't, uh -uh, you don't descend, you know. If somebody is telling you that they can go low, you just show the person some class. Show the person how to behave. Displaying this kind of attitude in the public is unethical and uncalled for and irresponsible. Great mothers, what type of messages are you sending to your young stars? People should think of consequences of action before reacting. Okay, on this note, we have come to the end of the news. We say thank you for tuning in to listen. Until I come here next time, enjoy the rest of the day.